Hatfield. I'm joined by Joe Massey, our Warsaw reporter here at the Express and Star. Joe, Warsaw finished their season away at Fleetwood Town. Is there a whole lot riding on this game? Um, no, and how nice is it to be able to say that? Thank yeah. God there isn't a lot riding on this game. Uh, yeah, as we all know, Walsall was safe, um, mm. secured that thanks to that draw at Bradford on Tuesday night. So, yeah, bit of a bit of a damn scrib really at Fleet yeah. on the final day, but it's going to be, uh, to be honest, I think everyone's going to enjoy that. Everyone's just going to sit back, um, enjoy a day out at the seaside, and hope yeah. and just watch a bit of football and then go home and think, oh, well. Season's over, at least we're saying everything's okay. So, mm. going to be an interesting game. Uh, Fleetwood not been in great form recently. They've had a really strange season. Um, yeah. Missed out on the playoffs last year, of course. Um, they were expected to challenge again. Udo Rossler wasn't able to do that. Mm. Um, he was sacked. John Sheridan came in, studied the ship, got them up the table, made them safe pretty quickly. Mm -hmm. um, but he isn't the man who's going to take them forward. They've made the shock appointment, really, of Jerry Barton yes. um, as manager. Um, he is going to take over after his... Ban is uh, completed. He's currently mm. banned from football for breaching betting regulations. So, Fleetwood are going to have a point to prove. They're going to want to impress a new manager. Yeah. Um, we're also going to want to go out on a high. Um, uh, 1,200 fans going up. Um, mm. Final day of the season. They normally go up in fancy dress. Right. Um, I know a lot of them are going up as George Dobson. Oh, very uh, nice. And they've got some George Dobson's uh, masks made. So, there'll be a few George Dobson's in the crowd as well as one on the pitch. So, yeah, final day. But the most important thing is just to enjoy it, really, because... Walsall are safe, so yeah. it's as good as done. Is your George Dobson mask in the car? Or? Oh, it is, mate. Yeah, yeah, I'll be sat there in a press box wearing my George Dobson mask. Yeah, I've got one of them. So we're all on the George Dobson bandwagon at the moment, aren't we? But I couldn't be happier for the lads. So. Yeah, yeah, fair play. And does Dean Keats have any team news to worry about? Any injuries? Or is it going to be one where maybe give the kids a bit of a run-up? I think he's hinted at changes. Um, mm. he's only, he hasn't got that many options. Um, but I think he will make a few changes. He said that... It's been a tough couple of months, a really tough couple of weeks, and it has been the same 11, by and large, that's mm. gone out onto the pitch. There has been a few changes along the way, but it has really only been one or two. Um, so I think he will look to maybe look at one or two players who he hasn't got to see in match action. Obviously, mm -hmm. he's got to see them train, but it'd be good to see them actually performing over a course of 90 minutes. Who it'll be, it's very difficult to say. Maybe Maz Kuyar will get a chance on the yeah. wing. We also are short of wingers, so it's an opportunity for him to play. And you'd like to think Mitch Candlin will get a go at front because he is a, a youngster with an awful lot of potential. So mm -hmm. maybe those two, but Corey Roberts will probably continue at right back to have another look at him there. But yeah. Yeah, there will be some. It'd be interesting to see what he does, but you'd imagine there will be one or two changes just so he can just so he can assess players really. Yeah. So thank God nothing is playing on or hanging over Warsaw on this game, the final day of the season. One to enjoy for Saddlers fans. You can catch the game live with us on Express and Star 